Hello YouTube, uh, today I'd like to talk about something very serious, uh, very horrible nowadays, uh, the coronavirus, COVID-19. So recently in Malaysia, uh, the cases, the confirmed cases for COVID-19 is 129 confirmed cases and 25 recovered cases uh, which is still I believe it's still under control uh, still yeah still in the beginning stage so it should be okay if you can control it very well and for the rest of the world you can see here uh, the confirmed cases around the world is about hundred thousands around the world besides China mainland it's about ten thousands cases confirmed cases in Italy and eight thousands in Iran South Korea 7.5 and of course other places as well and so you can go and see by your own all the statistics here is only those that reported uh, I believe there's still a lot of cases that's not reported so the number should be more than that uh, this is what I believe yeah of course the reasons for today's video is I share some important information uh, throughout my research on this coronavirus COVID-19 and first of all, this is not medical wise, this is only personal sharing. So if you need to know more about the virus, uh, go search by your own. Uh, there's a lot of information in the internet. Yeah, back to the information. Uh, we receive a lot of information about this coronavirus uh, from the social media, uh, from your local news, local television, local media, or even from your whatsapp and whatever information you receive before you fully believe the information that you receive please go and verify it before you yeah before you believe it so there's a lot of fake cases fake informations that in the whatsapp group so do verify and for me personally i i like to share some websites first is the world health organization there's a lot of useful informations from this WHO yeah so if you are interested you can go and search by your own I would like to share some information uh, from this mainly from this website yeah some information that I think is important yeah so you can go and search for this World Health Organizations WHO under the topic uh, COVID-19 so I'm gonna cover something that is for me it's important and of course it's important for you as well this is my own view at first of all the name for this virus is called uh, COVID-19 it's not Wuhan virus yeah the official name is called COVID-19 uh, actually kind of disagree with those who call it as Wuhan virus although it's understandable that why they call it that way but for me it's kind of rude yeah, it's actually stereotype or prejudice to call to call a virus with a location name. Yeah, it's definitely very bad. Just like Spanish flu. Yeah. The thing I'd like to share here is from this WHO website as well. Uh, yeah, which is very important for any individual to protect yourself from this coronavirus. Wearing mask. Yeah, there's three type of masks in the market, uh, which is quite common. The first thing is about this. Yeah, this type of medical mask, which I have few. And for more protection, you can have this. Uh, where's the box? Yeah, here. Yeah, this is the KN95, which can protect yourself uh, from the dust, uh, about 95%. So it's good enough for the for the COVID nineteen virus, and of course, so far in the market, this would be the best. Yeah, it's N ninety five. I would not take this unless I'm going to the hospital or to some to some dangerous places. Then only I'll keep this. Uh, only have one of this, so. Most of the time, I'll just take this if I go up from my house and this 
list of uh, KN95 if I'm going to those places that uh, a lot of people like in the train always remember that those with color uh, like this is black color I'm not sure you can see or not this is black color and at the back is slightly uh, lighter it's white color the white color always facing the mouse and you can knock it uh, this is actually the mask for today bluish slightly lighter always inside yeah, it's not advisable to to reuse the mask but since I'm now in my own place we wash the mask uh, it might it cannot be used anymore but for yeah for display is still still okay because I believe it's clean this is the yeah just make sure that it's tight enough here and this side as well and try to not reuse it every day it might not effective anymore so yeah but my problem here is I, I try to go and get yeah I try to go and get more masks uh, like for month ago but it seems like uh, the mask is actually out of stock I do not know where this mask go uh, especially when I, I'm in a train I, I seldom see people wearing masks in Malaysia but the mask is out of stock so it's kind of big questions mark that where's the mask yeah where's the mask go mm, I don't know yeah, so the next step I'd like to share here uh, is try to use hand sanitizer uh, more often uh, this is a normal hand sanitizer I bought it from Big Eon actually so it's just simple just punch it and yeah before you want to touch your face please do remember that do not touch your face before you clean your hand uh, it's kind of for me it's kind of very important yeah because we do not know what we touch especially we are outside and I'm outside I like to bring this style of hand sanitizer yeah it's spray form so just spray on it and wipe yeah and clean the hand properly yeah try try oftenly use this hand sanitizer uh, especially in this period before the COVID-19 gone so yeah it's kind of important to have this habit yeah this is all my personal thought about this hand sanitizer yeah and the next thing I'd like to share here is according to all the informations that I I searched from the internet uh, from this WHO from this commentary on Kesehatan Malaysia uh, this virus actually affected true human uh, which mean I do not be in those crowded area crowded places if you don't have to try to avoid that if possible and of course for those like taking public transport like in the train uh, yeah this is kind of difficult to avoid it uh, you can't really skip your work or your school especially in this early stage so if you can't avoid that uh, try to use mask or hand sanitizer bring this stuff yeah this is portable hand sanitizer uh, wear a mask when you're in the train so you can protect yourself I believe it's enough yeah I hope it's enough so yeah just protect yourself from it so this is basically the information that I'd like to share uh, after reading those articles or those watching those video from this WHO website and this commentary on Kesehatan the information that I mentioned just now is, are actually from these websites yeah so just verify it before you fully believe whatever you say and I will share these three links here you know, under, un, under here in the description box so if you are interested you can go watch it uh, yeah just keep, keep an eye on it uh, I believe uh, we can go through so for those of you who, who is affected by this coronavirus uh, please stay strong and for those of you who are safe 
please keep yourself protect yourself especially from those who are in Malaysia so that's that's a, that's the information that I like to share and some personal thought about this coronavirus uh, for me personally uh, some of you I believe some of you will say that uh, am I overreact about this coronavirus COVID-19 yes I might be overreact especially in Malaysia in the beginning stage I just don't want myself to be the one that who passed this yeah passed this COVID-19 virus to other people around me uh, especially my wife and my family so in order for that the only thing I need to do to avoid myself spreading this virus out is protect myself from this virus yeah as long as I'm safe so my family member will be safe so in order to protect them I protect myself with this and this I'm still doing a lot of normal activity I still go out for food I still go have a walk with my with my wife I still going to the shopper market it's just that I bring this and this with me so this is what I can do and this is so far I believe what I need to do to protect myself and my family as well so am I overreact yes I believe I am but I rather to be overreact instead of splitting this virus from me this is actually the main objective that why I'm doing this yeah, with the mask as well we can go through this very soon so just stay strong not just for Malaysian for anyone around the world uh, just try to protect yourself wearing masks is just a simple actions to protect yourself so please do that again I'd like to mention here whatever I share just now is not medical advice uh, if you need to know more you can go and search online uh, yeah the website is here uh, whatever I share here is just some informations uh, that I believe might help you uh, if you don't know what to do to protect yourself yeah I hope it helps yeah so that's all the information that I'd like to share here and for those of you who have subscribed just the link like and share it so stay strong and I believe we can go through this very fast very soon all the best